Good morning, right now I'm in Harvard Yard. As you see, the snow on the ground, everything's beautiful right here. It's When I woke up this morning, it said it was negative two degrees. So I can't really feel my face right now, but I just wanted to give you guys a, a quick little update as these people pass by. Go ahead, sir, man. Uh, it feels good to be here for the first day of classes. Everything is uh, everything is going great. I I am ready for this semester. Like I said in previous vlogs, last semester was real tough, but I've learned from it, and I'm about to take this one head on and do big things. Hopefully, you know, stay focused and, and stay driven. So for all those going through those finals right now in high school, please keep on trying hard, and even though it's tough. Keep on making it through because it's going to be worth it when you get to go to the East Coast or wherever you go in a different environment and see all this beautiful weather with the trees and the snow. So since it's the first day of school, I had to go to the financial aid office and get some things in order. And on my way there, because I didn't bring a beanie, I had to take a quick break at Starbucks because I could not feel my ears. I, because I had the Will Smith ears, this, this, these things stick out and they get cold, man. I cannot feel them right now at all. I can't feel my fingers touching them right now. It's so cold right now. Um, just taking a quick break. I'm sorry. I'm a little delirious from the cold, but hopefully Starbucks doesn't make me order anything. I'm just going to chill in here for like two minutes and, you know, wait, wait till these puppies warm up because I'm in trouble. <laughs> We're now at the Harvard Tea Station on Saturday. The first week of classes went really well. I'm ready to take on the semester as hard as I can. I made it to the financial aid office. You guys saw my ears almost fell off, but I made it. Um, one really quick thing to always remember when you guys make it to college is always have a good relationship with your financial aid officer because you got to get that money right. You know what I mean? You, gotta, you, you have to be able to pay for college to get the college experience. So your senior year, make sure you prepare for the FAFSA because that's one huge part of just being able to pay for college. You get funding. It's the free application for student aid. And make sure you have your funds all in line. Right now, we're actually about to pick up the Japanese delegates for the Harvard College in Asia programs conference that's going to be going on this coming week. It's going to be really exciting. And I just wanted to fill you guys in. We're about to get the subway right now. So right now we're at the airport waiting for our Japanese delegates to get here. We're very, very excited. They can come in through the door at any minute now. Uh, and we're just waiting. And the conference is going to begin for us as soon as they walk in through that gate. So I'm here waiting with the rest of my uh, Japanese delegate teammates ready to welcome in the, the Japanese delegates with some signs. And then I, I, so they asked, they asked me, do you have anything, you know, from Japan, anything like that? And I said, no, but I have this shirt with Bowser on it and Nintendo's from Japan, right? So I figured that was close enough. How are you guys doing? <laughs> now that our Japanese delegation has arrived, let me give you some more info on HCAP. The Harvard College in Asia program, or HCAP, is this really cool organization I've been working with this year that brings together students from Harvard and students from universities all over Asia through a set of exchange conferences between the Harvard campus and university campuses in places such as Bangkok, Beijing, Dubai, Hong Kong, Istanbul, Mumbai, Seoul, Singapore, Tokyo, and more. HCAP conferences are very different from typical academic conferences. They are holistic experiences. From lectures by top professors to excursions into the city, HCAP serves as a platform for student exploration and development by fostering intellectual, cultural, and social engagement. One of the experiences you wanted to share with them was ice skating. And, oh, <laughs> yeah, I kind of almost fell there. But anyway, uh, check out how it went. Learn how to do it better and better every day. <laughs> so right now I'm here at Frog Pond in Boston with the Harvard College and Asian Program Conference. We took the uh, the delegates out to the ice skating rink, trying to teach them how to how to ice skate. Some of them are a little bit more timid than others, but that's understandable. I was the same way when I came for the first time. Um, I, I, I taught one of my friends how to skate. It was great. Um, we're just kind of... How do you guys feel ice skating for the first time? It's awesome, but like I fell twice and... Oh. See, they're having a good time. Uh, life is about experiences, it's about getting to know other cultures, about getting to know different, uh, you know, ways of life and different activities. So. All in all, a great way to start off sophomore spring. Remember, fill out that FAFSA, people. And a special shout out to my friend and the delegate I was hosting, Yusuke. I'll see you in Japan in March, man. I can't wait. Now to close, the stylistic sounds of the man, the legend, Adi, straight from India, singing a traditional song. Check it out. Who's a dealer, Bandu Kijo? 
सभी लशिका